my page. Um, I just want to say welcome to my page. I did not plan for this. Hi, hi everyone. I am Jill Jeffries, and if you guys are new to my page, I just want to start off with, um, with saying that I am a college student from North Carolina. Um, I am a social work major, and I just want to say welcome to my YouTube page. This episode of College Code. I pretty much give you guys a scoop on everything that you guys need to know about college, from the parties to the studying to the dormitory relationships and talking. Because I know you guys have a tons and tons of questions because this is you guys' first time. Um, I'm assuming away from home and like I see you guys have a lot of questions and you don't know what to expect and a lot of the, um, the things that I have people to talk about this is stuff that I wish that some people would have told me before I came to college and yeah things of that nature so don't worry so don't worry guys I got you and yeah <laughs> college and I remember when I first came into college my freshman year I just had a lot of questions I was just like what do I bring? What you know? What do I wear? I'm mean, not pretty much what I wear, but like I just had a lot of questions because I was the first in my household um, to go to college. So I just want to like, I just had a lot of questions. I was like, so what are the classrooms like? Uh, what are the professors like? What is the calf like? That's a big thing. What is the calf like? Um, but every college is different. But this is just, you know, just a little video. I just want to help you guys, and it's called College Code. So I'm hoping, I'm hoping that I at least help someone the best way I can. Um, and I had other student leaders as well that go to school with me. Um, for some people that know, I do attend Fable State University out here in North Carolina. And along with me and other student leaders, we tried our best, and we hope that we'll be able to help some person out there that's about to go to college. And you know, pretty much things of that nature. So you guys, um. I hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you like it. And be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, please, because I don't stress that enough. I don't like if people just watch my videos and don't subscribe. So, yeah. Mm. Yeah, I think that was it. So, yeah, if there's anything that we didn't cover, I know we couldn't cover, like, everything because I did kind of start this a little bit last minute before I decided to go back home but I just want to get as much video footage as I can so if there's still like any questions that you guys happen to have and I didn't cover it in the video please be sure to leave it in the comment section like at the bottom and um Hi, I'm Marquita Stepney. I am 23 years old and a senior here at Fayetteville State University, major in mathematics education from the 2-5. Oh my God. Come on, come on. If I have any advice for the freshmen, it is to stay focused. Keep your eye on the prize and remember to begin with the end in mind. As far as from high school to college, um, now you're not going to have your parent like over you. And a lot of times professors might say something to you if you start falling behind, but they more than likely won't or whatever. At the end of the day, you are an adult and you do need to own up and just start doing things. As um, a lot of times we have a lot of programs here on campus and a lot of other colleges do that will help you, you know, if you do start falling behind, or if you do need any help. So don't be afraid to, you know, say, hey, I need some help. My name is Miles Esther. I'm a business major, a junior, and um, I'm currently the vice president of the UMC. My tip for incoming freshmen is that in order to actually build collections, build um, connections and relationships, you gotta have to put yourself out and actually engage other people. And that's one of the ways to do that is actually by joining organizations or by simply going to people and introducing yourself. That will kind of help you along. Hey loves, my name is Jurene Jeffries. I am currently 21 years old and a sophomore at Johnson Wall University. My major is fashion merchandise and red summer. Advice I would give to many freshmen for college is to prepare for yourself. Know like how school is no joke. You gotta take school seriously and just hang with the right people. Go people might seem like cool and stuff at the beginning, but people are dusty boots all the way till the end. Hi, my name is Mary Forbes. Uh, used to be when I when I graduated from here in um, 1989. It was Mary C. Perry Marshall. Yeah, that was what it was. <laughs> <laughs> and um, I'm a returning uh, student at this, seeking my second degree in business entrepreneurship. And um, my first one was in marketing. And I am a senior. Uh, I've already done one year. So uh, at, when you're seeking your second degree, you don't have to go through all the basic courses anymore. <laughs> and um, what was the other one? It's about budgeting. 
budgeting your money. When you get your refunds, if you get your refund checks or if you have somebody that's giving you money or whatever, you need to take care of that money because it's not an a endless well. You know, I also have children that are in school. You know, well, my, my baby girl just graduated from A&T uh, last Saturday. But um, that was most important to tell her to get your refund money, take care of the things that you need to take, take care of six months of your rent, take care of six months of your insurance, take care of as much as you can take care of so that you don't have that worry uh, when, it's, when it's time to, to pay them again. You know, because you have six months, and if you have a, you know, get you, get you a little job or something like that, then that, then that's play money. But your refund money, you should take care of, and you should make it work uh, as for as long as it possibly. Can. I would always say, a lot of times, freshmen blow their refund checks because a lot of times they never had that much money before. I would always tell you, make sure you always do business before pleasure. So before you decide to put wear some, you know, some Jordans, make sure you at least have draws to put on. I tell the freshmen, don't rush into anything. Just simply because, you know, you're here for college. This is the time where you want to be selfish. And this is the time you need to take full advantage of networking and trying to make the best of yourself. Honestly, if you are going to be with somebody, be with somebody that makes you better. At the same time, you know, who you call it, don't just be out here giving it up to anybody or anyone. Because at the end of the day, that's your body. And there are things that go around on every single campus. Some that you can get off on. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you can't. <laughs> so, dating and relationships. I'm going to be real with you. Don't date in college because that's a distraction. You don't need a distraction. I would say as far as dorm life goes, um, it's what you make of it. You know, if you just sit up in your dorm all day and never really get involved on campus, then, hey, that's what your, you know, your campus life and experience will be. At the same time, uh, with your roommate, you know, don't try to be each other's mom and dad, but at the same time, you are going to find people that come from a different background as you do and have a different view on life. So just be ready. Freshman year, I would have uh, moved on campus because that's where you meet a lot of people. That's my advice if I'm freshman. Move on campus your first year. You know it's going to be bad, like the living areas, but that's what you need to do. When they come in the door, hide yourself because females are messy. They want to take the soap, the food, they can't clean, they can't flush, just clean. Just like, no. They messy. Um, another advice is don't have everybody in your room because having everybody in your room, see, that's okay, but trust them because everybody in your room all the time, it's like, y'all, y'all go home. It's like, you need your space sometime. And just keep your, your, your place clean, you know, the my pop up, you know. Probably what came in knowing about time management and knowing that you have to go to class and it's very important to go to class and to stay focused because you're on a certain path because you have four years or you want to get out of four years. So. I would have came in with a different mindset on focusing and graduating. So, I would recommend for any freshman to go out there the first year, like drawing, drawing clubs, they dancing, they cheer team, they gay club. Girls, everything out there for everybody. They got even a Yu Gi Oh club for the winner. Like, it's everything out there for everybody. And you get to meet people and come out your comfort zone. It's like you get to prevent yourself because nobody don't know you. It's like it's a whole nother person. You guys, I really hope that this video was really helpful to somebody. Like I said, you guys be sure to follow me on Instagram and Snapchat, and I'm leave the, I'm leave all that at the bottom. Um, another thing, so I end up. The, <laughs> excuse me. So I did end up getting the internship in uh, in Raleigh. So I was so happy about that, you guys. Your girl won't be a Dollar Tree this summer. Cause if I was a Dollar Tree, I would curse everybody. <laughs> Where she wants to be. Uh, uh, college, college girl, come sing with me. Fortune and fame, they don't even matter. I made it to the party with my baby on the ladder. Yeah. Got any cake.